हेलो गाइस, आई एम शांतनु उदासी बैक अगेन विद अनदर एडिशन ऑफ एआईएम वीकली न्यूज राउंड अप वेर वी गेट यू अप टू स्पीड विद द बिगेस्ट न्यूज ऑफ द वीक In the follow-up to our last week's story about WhatsApp having separate privacy policies in India and Europe, the government of India has finally responded by asking WhatsApp to withdraw its privacy policy. The nation's IT ministry has sent an official mail to WhatsApp head Will Cathcart regarding upcoming update to the app's data sharing policy. The mail contains following major points. First, is the grave concern for the choice and autonomy of Indian citizens. And secondly, why users in eu are exempt from the new privacy policy but their counterparts in india have no choice but to comply they have also said this is prejudicial to the interests of indian users it would be interesting to see how whatsapp will respond as they identify the south asian nation as its biggest market by users moving from whatsapp to its parent company facebook every image uploaded on instagram and facebook is captioned by an image analysis ai that ai system has improved which will be of great help to visually impaired users and will help us to find images with great ease this is that same ai that identifies your face in a picture and asks you to tag yourself in it alt text is a field in an image is metadata that describes its contents This relatively recent ability to automatically generate description about the content of the picture has been extremely helpful in making social media more accessible in general. Facebook created its automatic alt text system in 2016 and with its latest update the improved system recognizes 10 times more items and concepts than it did at the start. The new detailed description feature will come to Facebook first for testing though the improved vocabulary will appear on instagram soon the descriptions are also kept simple so they can be easily translated to other languages though the feature may not roll out in other countries simultaneously as it does in the us infosys has announced the launch of infosys cobalt ai an applied ai cloud to democratize artificial intelligence to its workforce and expand its ability to power ai driven transformation for enterprises built on nvidia dgx a100 systems the applied ai cloud will be offering massive compute density performance and flexibility This applied AI cloud will be an AI center of excellence allowing developers and project teams of the organization to access AI hardware and software stacks across private and public clouds. This will enable them to build contextualized services that deliver AI first business processes for enterprises. Nvidia DGX A100 systems will provide the infrastructure and the advanced computing power required to run machine learning and deep learning operations for the applied AI cloud. The Ministry of Electronics and Information Technology is set to establish a quantum computing applications lab in India in collaboration with AWS. This lab will accelerate quantum computing led research and development in the country while enabling new scientific discoveries. AWS will provide the technical and programmatic support to the lab. This quantum computing applications lab will provide quantum computing as a service to government ministries and departments, researchers, scientists, academia and developers to enable advances in areas such as manufacturing, healthcare, agriculture and aerospace engineering. Manthan Software, a leading cloud analytics provider and Rich Relevance, the global leader in experience personalization, have announced that they have rebranded and launched as a brand new AI company called Algonomy. The newly formed company will power digital first as the new normal for the retailers and brands across the globe. It will do so by rapidly unifying all customers' data in a single platform for real-time AI-based decisioning. With Algonomy, retailers of all sizes can finally place digital at the core of their businesses to operate, personalize and activate customer journeys to drive immediate engagement and return on investment across the life cycle. The company stated that its proven real-time customer data and analytics platform along with an intelligent ensemble based algorithmic decision engine and deep expertise in global retail will help brands engage customers with contextually relevant personalized experiences. So these were all the biggest update from the week. 
सब्सक्राइब टू ए आई एम्स यूट्यूब चैनल सो दैट यू नेवर मिस एनी अदर अपडेट